Hello, welcome, 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 welcome. Right, well, the day is finally here where we can open a, another miracle. This is from King Kid, as the uh, title says. Now, Fantastic Company King Kid is. I've had many great shopping experiences with them. They deal in both new and second hand kits, but all the second hand kits they sell, they check all the contents are there. Um, the kits from started basically you won't end up with a a model that comes to you pre-built or part built it won't be missing bits it'll all be as new basically they've checked to make sure it's all just so and their prices are very reasonable I find so let's just take a look this is the one I've alluded to in streams and videos that I've been looking forward to sharing with you, this, this model. It has a very cool feature, and I was put onto this feature by Harry Houdini uh, Models. He did a video about you know, what's on his workbench and the new kits he's got, and this was one of his new kits. Well, he had it showed a different version of it to me. I wanted a particular version of the, of the airplane, because... Um, it's got, um, yeah, it's not, I'd say it's not one of the proudest moments in British history, but uh, it's definitely when one of the times where America could have backed us and, and didn't. Uh, but uh, yeah, what happened happened. Anyway, the model is Western Wyvern. This is the 148 scale Wyvern. Late version S4 um, or 40 SK by Trumpeter. Um, box that gives it all away is the Suez Crisis, that's what I'm referring to, but I wanted to do an aircraft from Suez because it's important to acknowledge the less proud moments in your history. But it uh, also gives the aircraft from strike and finish. So, Wyvern was a strike air carrier born strike aircraft, so ground attack roll mostly. Um, powered by a turboprop engine, driving a twin contra, contra-rotating propeller. So you've got one going one way, one going the other way. Uh, a bit of a kit. Let's go. So you see the box is a bit, a bit battered in places because it's second hand, but you know, oh. the kit inside will have been checked. So it's all you, you can do. The air brakes deployed. Just in the details, and here is the fascinating feature. Trumpeter have actually designed a little gearbox that allows the propeller when you turn one, the other one will go the other way. And that's why I just had to, just had to have a go at it. So let's open the box, have a look. We have some photo wedge. We also have a uh, film piece for the instrument panel. So I'm guessing I just paint that that one black and then put that over the top of that. Maybe we'll find out. Um, here we have the instruction sheet. I I I've, I took a chance on a trumpet kit years ago. It's e Fury. Um, and uh, I've never heard of this company before, what they're like, I built it and loved it. And this, I've actually built many transfer kits since, this is the one of the first, yeah, film and decals, it has separate transfers, and separate, uh, he's building the, you can, you've got the choice, you don't have to put the gears in to make the propeller turn as, two, so basically two gears into that slot, okay, I see. Yeah, and it's all pretty much done enough. That is a whole range of weapons, rocket assist takeoff pieces, and all the rest of it. That's the rocket assist takeoff here. Bombs, there's a, there's a torpedo, all sorts of stuff can go on this. So, yeah, it looks like the flaps. 
possibly the flaps are positionable as well. The garage. The wings are folded. Unfoldable. You can have them foldable or extended. I think I'll have them extended myself. We have the wings folded. And then showing all the loadout options they could take. So you can have rockets and a torpedo, or you can have bombs, or you can have drop tanks and torpedo underneath. Uh, then the, the transfers, and as, as I said, it's all been checked, so it's all bagged. You see, it's doing its record bag. There's all the transfers in good, good order. And there's the painting guide. So we've got three different versions. There is uh, HMS Eagle 1956 on, uh, from, during the Suez Crisis. Um, HMS Ark Royal 1957 is the second one. And HMS Eagle 1958 is the third one. So the Suez Crisis would be the one I'll be doing there. And then there's Eagle and Ark Royal underneath. Quite an ungainly looking aeroplane, isn't it? <laughs> and now for some, wow! <laughs> now for some size! Okay, so there is the fuselage size on that one. Big, big aeroplane. There's a piece of metal rod there. Along with the transparencies, all in check. These are two enormous propellers. Torpedo. There. Aha. There is our gearbox assembly. Upper, upper wing roots and um, the flaps and the drop tanks. Ordnance and tyres. And the Ratto. Rocket says take off. And the remaining wing parts and the rest of hook and the rest of it. So everything's there, everything's on the spruce tool. All the bags are unopened. This is a Basically, and has new kit in a slightly touchy box. That's, that's literally the only the only thing going on with it. So excellent, but that's the assurance you can get from King Kit is they do actually check all this stuff to make sure that uh, you're not disappointed when you open the box. That should be quite impressive with a big contra those those huge propeller blades actually working. So yes, I'll. Uh, just pop all this away. That's an enormous aeroplane, isn't it? I mean, you you've all seen you saw the Spitfire last night on the on the stream now. Enormous. Enormous. Now this won't be a stream build. This for. This will be a uh, in private build mostly, but I will video the uh, building of the um, the gearbox and propeller assembly. Just, just so you can you can see how it all goes together, and you can watch me cry when it, it doesn't work. <laughs> I it up. So just briefly finish up. Um, the model has a length of. 268.5 millimetres and a wingspan of 279.5 millimetres. So, what was that? Roughly 27 centimetres long, 28 centimetres wide, roughly. So, yeah, it's not going to be small. It's not going to be a small plane. But, uh, oh, please. 